Hey guys, I'm Bianca. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a hair bow tutorial for you guys. I have been doing or making hair bows uh, for years and years because you know I have three girls. So um, I just wanted to show you guys today a simple, we're, we're going to start off with a simple uh, hair bow that anybody can do and then I will add some stuff if you want to get a little bit more um, detail with the bow so yeah um, let's go ahead and get started okay so you'll need a couple of things your glue gun some extra glue sticks a clip some ribbon some thread and scissors. Okay, so what you're gonna go ahead and do is get your ribbon and I'm gonna go ahead and just roll the ribbon out so I can see how much I need to work with. So what I'm gonna do is make a very easy, uh, I guess pinwheel type hair bow. So what you're going to do first is just start to assemble it. So I basically put it in half like this and then come back around again like that. And again. So something like this, that is pretty simple and just wrap it basically three times. So I guess that, that's a pretty good size, so I'm going to cut it. Okay. So what we're going to do is make sure all three um, parts of the ribbon are uh, about equal size. Remember, it doesn't have to be perfectly the same. So it is about the same. So after we have that, I'm just gonna leave it like that and then grab my thread. I'm gonna get it ready basically. So just keep it right there. And then you're just gonna grab it. Grabbing with my right hand, I'm grabbing the top of it and then my bottom head grabbing the bottom of it and you're just gonna do this so push it together and then come down with it back up and down up just do that to both sides Okay, you see what I did there? I just scrunched it up and down, up and down, and I'm gonna hold it like that. And then I'm gonna get my string, my thread, come from the bottom and just wrap it a lot of times. You don't, you wanna wrap it a lot of times so that way your bow is secure. So I wrapped it about, I don't know, 10 to 15 times. And then you're just gonna, oh no, you're just gonna tie it. I tied it once, but I'm gonna tie it about two more times. Just so it's secure. And then you're gonna cut off the excess string. Move it to the side. Okay. So this is how it looks, and now we're gonna fix it. Okay, so let's just make sure all the sides are about even. If not, you can pull some out a little bit. That's pretty good, it's pretty perfect. So yeah, I would say it's all about the same. So now, 
we have our bow. And so what we're gonna do now is cut the ends of the ribbon. So what I like to do, the best way is to fold it in half like this. And then just come with your scissors. So you see I folded it in half. So both sides are even. You just cut it like that. See? I'm gonna do this side. Okay, what I did forget to mention is you do need a lighter. So that way you can burn the tips of the hair bow and this won't happen. If you don't burn it, I mean, I guess it's okay, but you'll just have a lot of, um, of the bow like coming apart at the um, ends of it. So I like to get a lighter and just light that part. All right, so I'm gonna take it and just run it real, um, just run it along the edges kind of fast because if you stay in one spot too long, then it'll melt it. <laughs> okay, so that's it, just like that. So if you want, you can just leave it like that because that's that would be simple, right? So you could leave it like that and then just attach the clip, which I will show you at the end. But what I'm gonna do is add one more color to it. So this could be it. If you want a just simple bow, this will be the end of that. But I'm gonna add another color. So this is the detail part I was talking about. So I have this ribbon right here and I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing I did with this. I'm gonna do it with this ribbon except make it a little bit smaller. I'm just trying to see, yeah, I think that would be pretty good. So I'm gonna cut it right here. Get your string, your thread, and then just start wrapping it. And then do the same thing I did with the other bow. Okay, so this is how it looks. And if you only have one color ribbon, if you just have this ribbon, you can layer it on top with the same, same ribbon if you wanted to to just give it some texture. So what I'm gonna do is light it real quick. And then we'll connect them. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is put them together. Doesn't that look pretty? So in order to do that, we're gonna put them together. I like to put some hot glue right here and then put it on top and then I'll add more of the thread. So that's what I'm going to do. I'll just put it like this and that's how I'm going to wrap it. Okay, so that is pretty much it for the bow. Now, the last part we have to do is just add the um, ribbon in the middle and then put the clip. So I just want uh, some of the pink to stand out, so I'm gonna use this ribbon right here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tie a knot in it, like this, and it'll be the center piece for the ribbon right here. So I tied it, and then I'm just gonna pull it. I think it's good like that. And then make it to where it's like this. The ribbons basically and you can fold it in half on the top and then you can fold it in half on the other side too. So I'm just gonna cut it. I don't need that much. So let's go ahead and add some glue right here. And just set it there for a few um, seconds. 
just so it won't move while you're trying to tie it around the back. Now I'm gonna wrap it around. So let me go ahead and put some glue right here. Grab it like this and just set it there. Try not to burn yourself. I'm holding it open so if I put it down then it's gonna get stuck, you see? I'll get stuck. I've done this so many times and got have gotten burnt so many times, so I'm used to it. So then now that it's pretty much dry, you're gonna grab this ribbon and make sure it's in in half like this. And you're going to put it in there like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut some off because I don't need all that ribbon. And I'm gonna go ahead and glue it right there. So I'm opening it back up and adding some glue right here and putting that in there. So I'm gonna open the clip, add some more glue right here and then bring this one down and put it like that. Okay, so while that's drying, you're just tightening it up and then making sure this is all out. Make sure you fluff it out. Okay, I'm going to turn it back around and I'm going to cut off this excess um, ribbon. Alright, and that is pretty much it. It doesn't have to be perfect in the back because nobody's going to see that part. So, isn't that cute? I love it. It's so pretty. Okay guys, that is pretty much it for this tutorial. This is how the hair bow came out. It came out super cute and I'm sure my five-year-old is gonna love it. She likes, loves anything girly, so um, she's gonna like this. Um, but yeah, if you guys wanna see more hair bow tutorials or maybe there's a certain hair bow that you wanna see me make, just leave me a comment below. And as always, please subscribe if you like these type of videos i do diys um cook with me's clean with me's things like that um and i do about two to three videos a week so yeah that is it for this tutorial and i will see you guys soon bye